So welcome to my channel. I'm Bianca Janelle. I make videos on lifestyle. I do skincare videos, makeup tutorials, hauls, and today we are doing a winter haul. I am so excited. I did a little damage at Steve Madden, Zara, and Misguided. I have some goodies in here for winter, so if you guys want to see what I picked up, then please keep watching. Okay, so like I said in the intro, this is a winter haul. Haul. I'm so excited about it getting just a little bit cooler. I'm in San Diego, so it doesn't get that cold, but we do have some chilly days and nights. So I decided it was time for a winter haul. <laughs> so I'm going to start with Zara. This is actually my first time ordering from there. I've shopped the store, but I ordered from there and it got to the house in like two or three days. It was super quick, so I was super impressed by that. Last year was actually, I think last year was the first year I actually started shopping at Zara and I just fell in love with their clothing and the style. What I really loved from them was their coats. I have two coats, well actually one, I bought the same coat just in a different color and I wore it almost every day last winter. It was just so good to me. It was like just the perfect warmth. And it went with everything. So let's start with that. So it's actually this coat right here. I decided to get it in this camel color. I just think this camel color is so sophisticated. I just love how chic it looks. So this coat right here is the Tala coat. It is $49. And for $49, the quality, it feels like it's a couple hundred dollars. I love this. Like I said, this is a coat that I bought last year and I got it in gray. And now I'm regretting it because there was like a sandstone color and I wish I would have picked that one up. Well, maybe on my next Zara haul. I might have to pick it up. But I just, I love this. It's just a straight cut. So it doesn't really give you any shape. But I just like because last year I wore it a lot just like with jeans and boots. So I kind of gave myself shape underneath. And I just paired this on top. And I loved it. So I just knew that I had to pick it up in a different color. Now this color is just super in right now. Everyone loves like this camel nude brown tone palette and that's actually kind of a lot of what I've shopped recently so I'm super excited this will go with everything and I'm sure she's going to be loved like the way my coat from last year was loved so like I said because I love their coats I had to pick up a second one I needed a new fresh black coat and I also needed a coat with a hood so I got both I got a coat with a hood and it's black this one goes about to mid thigh this one was $70 Again, it's just such great quality. I love the way that this one wraps around. This one, does, the previous one does not have a closure to it. It's open. I like that about this. But on this particular one, I love that it has just the wrap closure. So you can wear it open or you wear it tight closed. It's going to keep you warm. And again, I just, I love the quality. It's just such a beautiful coat. And I got this one in a size medium as well. And it fits perfectly I just love the fit and style of this one so between these two coats I know I'm going to get a lot of use out of them and then and then the last item I got from Zara are these faux leather pants right here they're beautiful I love them as soon as it hit fall I knew that I needed faux leather pants like I said it doesn't get that cold here in San Diego so I've always been really nervous to wear faux leather but this one has like a nice fleece lining in it so it's going to keep you warm but I just I was worried about like a sticking to, to it kind of like a Ross moment from friends if you know what I'm talking about leave it in the comments but I know that that won't happen with this and the back there's no pockets whatsoever and these are just the slim fit these are a high rise and I just love the way as they fit and look the bottom has this zipper right here I love this detailing because you can kind of wear it as a straight leg or you can open it up and kind of let it kind of drape over some heels I see a lot of girls wearing their leather foot I see a lot of girls wearing their faux leather pants like that I just love that style so I'm super excited to pair this I have not in this haul but in my next haul I have a lot of sweaters coming in and I bought a lot of like boyfriend blazers, so I'm super excited to pair this with all of that. And my coats. I'm just excited to wear these. I'm, I think I'm most excited about this because this is something I've been wanting for a while. I just wanted to get a little bit more cooler here in San Diego. So I know I'm going to start getting a lot of use out of these. Okay, so next let's go to Misguided. 
I wanted to order faux leather pants from them as well just because I wanted to see the quality. I've never ordered from Misguided before. So I do prefer the Zara faux leather pants to be honest just because I like the lining and I just like the way that they fit and they look. I do like these. I will still wear these. I like that these ones have pockets in the back. But it just doesn't have that fleece lining like the Zara ones do. So I'm like more nervous about these ones. So I mean it has to be like a cold day. And the reason why I don't particularly like these ones as much either are because like they kind of make a sound. Like the Zara ones don't make a sound whatsoever. I know, I think I read somewhere that you, there's kind of like a wax or something that you can put on your faux leather pants that like kind of helps with that sound that way like if your thighs are like rubbed together or something or just like even like crossing your legs that will help with that sound and I think it adds like a little bit more shine to it. I love that the way that they look and, and they fit. Like to me, I, I do. I really, really enjoy that. Do these? No, these don't have zippers within. They're just a straight leg. Like I said, I do like the way that I think I have to get them altered because they're a little bit long on me. But to me, it's just like the best sound and if I'm going to get really warm with warm in them so that's just what makes me a little bit nervous but again on like a particularly cold day I will wear these but I do prefer the Zara ones and the pricing on these were $30 so for an additional I think the Zara leggings are $30 too let me see they were $35 so I say if you're gonna pick one I would go with the Zara ones but I do like these these are a little bit more shiny. Like I said, they have the back pocket, so I do enjoy that. But I'll keep you guys updated on these. Okay, so the next item we have is this sweater dress right here. I just wanted a plain black sweater dress. But as you can see, it is a little bit see-through. Um, so I would just wear a black slip underneath it. Either you wear like a lacy slip underneath it or just something basic. Um, that's my only problem with this, but once I wear the slip, it's going to be fine. Or you can use this as a layering piece. It is actually pre pretty short. I didn't expect it to be that short. So probably what I would do, I'd probably wear like thick black stockings with it and then thigh-high boots. I think you have a really chic look right there. Or I would just pair it with a trench coat. That way you don't really have to worry about the shortness of it. But I really like it. I like that it's super lightweight. Like I said, being here in San Diego, it doesn't get that cold. So sometimes these sweaters get like just really hot. But this one's just nice and thin. And like I said, once you wear a slip underneath it, you'll be fine. But I like it. I just needed something really basic like this. Pro probably the way I would pair this, I'd probably wear this with like my thigh-high boots and a leather jacket on top. I think that would be a really cool look. Or like I said, you can be a little bit more chic and put some stockings underneath it with like maybe some Chelsea boots I think that would be a really cute look as well so I like it like I said I just needed something really basic and that's what I got but the next thing I got were these jeans right here I don't think they're what I ordered <laughs> it's funny now that I'm looking at a receipt they're not what I ordered so I'm probably going to have to return these I wanted like some a-line jeans and these ended up being mom jeans which actually I don't have any so I'm kind of going back and forth of whether or not I should keep them and learn how to style them or I should return them because I just looked at my receipt right now and they are not what I ordered so I really just made a mistake but they are really cool I do like them I like the rips in them and then you have a really raw hem like I said they are really different from anything that I do have um but I don't think it's what I ordered. I'm going to have to just make sure with the barcode and everything. But they are cool. They are trendy. So we'll see. I'll keep you guys updated on them. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, so the next item we have is the item I am most excited about. This is why I placed the order. Was because I have been wanting an aviator jacket for so long. And I saw that it came in this champagne color. I just fell in love with it. I love how chunky, big, it's just so gorgeous. I don't, I haven't seen anything like this. Usually when I see aviator jackets, they usually come like in black or brown, but it being the champagne color, I thought was a very different. I'm so excited to wear this throughout winter. It's very warm because the lining 
because of the line you can see right here that is all throughout the jacket so like I said it's going to keep you very very warm and I went up a size in it just so it could be really oversized so whether you want to layer this up or just throw this on your shoulders with a dress I think it's going to be really cool and this isn't anything like I have in my closet I usually go for a lot of like faux leather jackets or coats so this is just a different piece than what I have so I'm really excited to style this up and it's just super pretty again I'm going to like Again, I'm going to link everything down below for you guys to check out. Misguided was having, I believe, like an additional 60%. They really have good sales all the time. So you just kind of have to be on the lookout. So if you ever see one, like at 30 40% weight, because within the following weeks, it usually goes to like 50 or 60%. And I just so happened to get everything at 60%. So I was winning that day. And then the last one we got is this faux leather jacket right here. I just needed another basic faux leather ones. I wear my faux leather jackets like crazy over fall and winter. So I just wanted to get a different color. It's like this gray sandstone color right here. Again, it's a great neutral. It will pair with everything. It's got a great fit. The hardware is silver. A lot of my jackets are coming like black and gold. So again, this is just a little bit different than what I have. And I wanted it, again, as you can see, I'm kind of going for a very neutral palette this season. Again, when you get neutral stuff, it really pairs well with everything and it's really interchangeable. So again, I really like this. The quality is great. I believe I got this for $25. Either got it for $25 or $30. So again, the pricing wasn't bad at all. I'm really excited about the clothing that I've got, like I said, it's very appropriate for one time. I'm excited to style everything up. So that was it for clothes. Now let's move on to shoes. Okay, so the first pair of shoes we have are these heels right here. These tortoiseshell heels. I love these. If you guys watched my last fall haul, you guys know that I got a pair of tortoiseshell heels from Express. Oops. That I truly love so when I saw them in these peep toed forms I knew I had to grab them I just love how chic and how neutral they are again they're going to pair with everything and Steve Madden is such a comfortable shoe they're some of my favorite it's one of my favorite brands to shop for because I know that their shoes are always comfortable you do have a high heel it's probably about maybe about four and a half inches right there but they're so comfortable that and throughout time, they do stretch out. So a lot of the time, I like to just wear them in the house to kind of get my feet adjusted to them. And then that way, by the time I wear them out, they're ready to go. Again, it's just a great neutral shoe to have. It makes a great work basic or, again, even just going out because it is that pointed toe with the high heel. It's very sexy. I love these. I'm super excited about wearing these. Okay, the next pair of shoes we have are these booties right here these are the latch booties i have been eyeing these since like august i don't even know where I, well of course i saw them on the website but i saw them somewhere i must have saw someone wearing them and i fell in love with them now this is nothing like i have in my closet i don't usually wear a combat boot at all but i just think that they are so fun to me they're like a cross between a combat boot and a chelsea boot i really like them and again i love how high the heel is to me that was really important and they're comfortable because they have this platform on the bottom right in the back they have a little bit of give kind of has like that soft material and they are a zip up they are so comfortable so in Steve Madden usually I am true to size I'm always a size 7 in heels I always buy 7 but in boots I do size I do go a half a size up just because it's sometimes I like to wear thicker socks with them so in the boots I, I did get a 7.5 and, and then in the pumps I did get a 7 just for shoe reference for you guys but again for them being this high they are so comfortable I really like these I I just had like an outfit in my head as to how I wanted to wear them I wanted to wear them with gray skinny jeans just a white v-neck top and a, my faux leather jacket I thought that was going to be such a great look I really like these I think I'm gonna get a lot of use out of them and I love the trend of pairing something like chunky and a little bit more edgy like this with something very feminine i love that mix that's going on right now you, you'll you'll start to see a lot of girls in dresses and then they pair them with combat boots or chelsea boots so again i thought this was like the perfect mixture between the two so i'm really happy with these okay we're at the last item 
of this haul and probably my most favorite part of this haul are these viking boots right here they're these thigh high boots these are gorgeous <laughs> i love them they're so sexy it's about a four inch heel again with the pointy toe and what i like on the top of these boots is it kind of has like i don't know what you would call this mm, it's just a lining right here and this helps stick to your thigh like I there's nothing worse than when like that high boots rise down but these won't do that because they have that like little section right there that's going to hold on to your thigh <sighs> they are definitely my favorite I think every girl should own a pair of thigh high boots it always makes you feel so comfortable and confident and I just love them I know I'm going to get a lot of use of them every year I do buy a new pair of thigh high boots that I literally wear to the ground so I'm super excited about these again you can see how high the heels and they're actually very comfortable for being as skinny as the heels and the pointing toe they're very comfortable they're easy to walk in and again it's going to go with so many outfits again you can wear this with sweater dresses or like I said you can even wear it with like some faux leather shorts I think that would be a really cute look with thigh high boots there's just like endless possibilities. You just can't go wrong with a classic pair of black boots. So I'm really excited about this. Okay, so that was everything in my haul. In the comments down below, tell me what item of clothing you are excited to wear in winter time. And if you guys want to see a haul from another place, I do have a couple more orders coming in. So I will be doing a couple more winter hauls for you guys. So if you like these videos, well then give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye.